settlement reached, union workers and Disney have agreed on a contract that's going to raise starting pay for Disney employees. Right now, you can see a news conference is happening on what's being called a historic contract settlement. This is a live look from that press conference. Disney workers have been fighting for years for $15 an hour, and today, Disney agreed. Good evening to you. I'm Eric Von Anken. Glad you're with us tonight. Disney says the money is going to be one of the highest entry-level service wages in the country. News 6's Jerry Askin has the specifics of this deal. Disney's job is to be frugal. The union's job is to get as much money as they can. The back and forth fight for higher wages has gone on for years, and Disney workers who simply want more money say today's news is good news. Four, six, eight. Disney don't discriminate. They've been protesting and asking for more than 10 bucks an hour for quite some time. <laughs> Today, Disney and the Service Trade Council, who represents thousands of Disney employees, announced their tentative agreement. Workers, though, must vote to approve this plan next month. The change will raise starting pay for non-tipped workers from 10 bucks an hour to 15 per hour by 2021, with workers seeing an increase each year. They'll also get 50 cents retroactive pay from last September. And workers who already make 15 bucks an hour, they'll still see a raise of up to $4.75 by 2021. I'm told workers may still be eligible for overtime. We do know Disney officials met with union reps back in May to discuss several options and negotiate. Negotiations, many Disney workers say, have all been worth it. Jerry Askin, New Six.